Well, earlier this year, the Arizona Board of Regents approved a multi-year tuition structure to increase the cost for resident students at Arizona's public universities. Today, U of A released their proposed six-year growth rate structure. News for Tucson's Zoe Zendor is standing by at the U of A to explain all of this. Zoe. Yeah, U of A proposing a 3% increase for resident tuition and a 4% increase for non-resident tuition. That's for the 2023-24 uh, school year. Now, the proposal is under a six-year maximum growth rate, and this includes uh, tuition, meal plans, and housing, and even academic fees. This does come to a little bit of a surprise to some students. I don't know. I don't know anything about it. I would like to know where that money's going specifically. I know over COVID, um, they just cut all the professors' pay equally, even though certain departments were generating much more money than others. Um, so I think some more transparency would be nice. It's kind of scary because I'm an out-of-state student, so I'm already having to deal with a really large amount of money I have to pay. Um, I'm lucky enough to have like a couple scholarships, but they don't cover all of it, and so it's kind of still like a thing you know, my parents are dealing with. And again, this is a proposal. It has not been approved yet. So what's the next step? Now, there's going to be a meeting on March 23rd where the proposals will be closely reviewed by the Capital Finance and Resources Committee. And then to follow that up, March 28th, there's going to be a hearing where students and the public can speak about this topic. And finally, on April 20th, the board is hoping to approve the set tuition and fee amount for the 2023-24 uh, school year. And I'm out at the University of Arizona for News 4, Zoe Zandora.